Somebody save me, please. Oh, it's not that bad. I'm entertaining. Welcome to the Pull Your Holes <laughs> Shopping Network. <laughs> I'm Sam. I'm Katie. Hi. Today Hello. We're gonna, oh. Oh. Up. Today we're going to talk about <laughs> hangers, I guess, right? Not for your clothes. Not for your clothes. Not clothes hangers. Nope. We're going to talk about shark tooth. Ooh, uh. <laughs> Is that from Finding Nemo? Yes, it is. Yeah, I have a, I have a six-year-old. What, yeah, what's the kid's name? Does she shakes the bag. What's her name? I don't know. I just know she comes in and goes, uh, Piranha. We get a lot of questions about the hangers. And I think the big one is how they fit. Because a lot of these, we only carry in one size as far as the hook goes, or maybe mm -hmm. two or three sizes. And they fit great. But the great thing about it is you can put them in a hole that's bigger, and they kinda, they're mm -hmm. not going to cause you to shrink up. You got looking fancy on the night. Right, yeah, because like definitely right now, like the big thing is like wearing like the like silicone like clear ear skins or something like that, and then using one of these to go through there, because mm -hmm. um, it just kind of dresses it up a little, you know. And who doesn't love to get dressed up? Get a little bougie. Bougie. I don't know where you're gonna go. Get bougie at half the price. Because everything's closed. Yeah, that's why the <laughs> internet is great. <laughs> We've been busy. Yeah. Yeah, because uh, apparently people can't go out and shop in person, so. Shop online at PlugYourHoles.com. There's like a weird pandemic thing happening. Right mm-hmm, mm-hmm. These are one of my favorites. These mm -hmm. are the glass bottles. We have these in a couple colors. I think we have them in purple and... Purple and maroon and blue. Okay. They look like a... What's the difference between maroon and purple? Uh, the r undertone. The un oh, okay. Yeah. There used to be a band called The Undertones. Hmm. hmm. I think they were ska. They sound like if ska. If there's a tone in the name, it's probably a ska band. Probably, right? <laughs> For those of you who don't know what ska is, <laughs> Wikipedia it, or look up... I don't know, rancid or something. Yeah. yeah, I mean you'll get some sort of an idea. Or uh, real big fish. Real big fish. Right. Less than Jake. E, there you mighty, go. Mighty mighty boss tones. Yes. Those are the those are the big ones. Yeah. Yeah. So tone again. Tone. Well yeah. played. Yeah. Yeah. Well. Skeletones. <laughs> Skeleton. Is that real? I think it's a real band. I didn't listen to a lot of ska. If you know, let us know underneath the video. If you know, you yeah. know. If you know, you know. Put it in yeah. the comments. These I like a lot. I'm always worried about how fragile they are, but these things actually seem to hold up pretty well. I, yeah. mean, I don't think we've even, as we ship them, I don't even think we've had very many damage in the mail, but we would replace them if they were hypothetically right. damaged. But yeah, uh, quality, and they stay in your ears pretty well. Um, I think these ones probably about 14 millimeter, mm -hmm. about 9 sixteenths, so you've got to be at least that size to wear them. But we really only carry them in one size, and then obviously if you have bigger ears, you can wear other sizes. Right. Some of these get a little tricky, though. <laughs> This is like a skull <laughs> of, a, of some. This is a bird. Right. Yeah, it's a bird. Uh, yeah. I think it's black bird skull. Black bird skull. Mm hmm. Is what it. No, that's literally. We what try it's really yeah. hard with the names here. Yeah, when you start bringing in so many different animals and birds, it's hard to keep them all straight. And what kind of bird? Is that yeah. like a toucan or. Ask Laura. Did. My wife would know. She <laughs> loves birds. Wilderness Wednesdays. Wilderness Wednesdays. <laughs> so the thing about these is you. Kind of, you can't really go on the size of the wearable area right. because you see here it's, it's wider, and you kind of have to be able to get it past the widest points. Right, otherwise it's going to be a disaster. Right, so so it's just something to keep in mind with some of these. You know, kind of look at them and get a, a better uh, a, a Idea, judge yeah. based on what your size is. But something like this, you know, we have some of them clasp open, and and those are obviously you're able to get those in. Now these SOBs. Should we just do it? Should we just try to put them in? I'll put it in. I could do it. Well, because I. Because you can do one. I'll, I can hey, do you one. do one, I'll do the other. Cool. Okay. So. I'm I, a two. I'm a two and a zero. <laughs> so. She can't commit to anything. I can't. <laughs> these are a. So these hang with both antlers. These hang just fine for me, but you can only get one in. I can only get one antler guy in, but. A two gauge. Right. Yeah. So two gauge, that's typically going to be. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That goes right in. This might be the zero here. She doesn't even know. Anyway. <laughs> so I'm at 22 millimeter, also known as 7 eighths for all of us American folks who refuse to switch to the metric system. Uh, and this is, it goes in with ease. So yeah. I'm not saying, I, I'm not sure what size exactly it would start at. I believe one of our employees is at 16 millimeter and yes. I don't think she can get them in. No, Meg said that it was, it was tough. Okay. Yeah, she does so, our image plugs. Warning. If you're 16 millimeters or below, probably not going to fit. But I think probably about that 19, 20 millimeter mark, I think they're going to fit in just fine. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. And again, you can always wear them like this too. I mean, even though it's just the one antler and like I don't have very large ears compared to Sam or, you know, t the typical customer, but these don't feel too heavy. And even like, yes, I'm usually wearing hoops, but these hoops literally weigh nothing. So it's not like it's weighing my ear down or too much. I don't feel like it's stretching it or anything. So this is still an option too for anybody that has smaller sizes under 20, mm -hmm. 22. 
My only concern with something like this is that there is a texture on the horn itself. Mm -hmm. And so I wouldn't want it to be in somewhere very tight just right. because it's going to hold on to like gunk. So yeah. it's kind of meant to be worn with something that has, uh, or with, with a with a ear hole yeah. that is large enough to be able to breathe. Uh, right. You wouldn't want to trap a bunch of gunk in there. Yeah. Because this definitely has some, some area, some room. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. So. And if you have any questions about any of the stuff we've shown or any of the other stuff that's in this family, feel free to comment below. We would love to answer your questions. Mm -hmm. And if you want to see other videos like this or about very specific topics, let us know in the description below. Or wait, that's the wrong word. Let us know in the comments below. <laughs> and make sure to like this video. Please subscribe. Tell your friends. Know. Tell your friends. Share this on the internets. Internets. Mm -hmm. On the Twitters, on the Instagrams, mm -hmm. the social medias. Speaking of the internets, Check out PlugYourHoles.com for all the stuff. We'll have links uh, to the kind of general category of stuff we're talking about with hangers. And uh, you can check out... Uh, all the other what, stuff. What tickles your fancy. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks. Bye.